about how as we get used to things our perception of them becomes automatic it use this is the analogy of um, habit becoming unconsciously automatic like how we might not fully notice the sensation of holding a pen or speaking a foreign language after doing it many times so the text suggests that uh, this habitu- habituation is why in everyday speech we often leave phrases unfinished or words half expressed it introduces the idea that in this process things are simplified and replaced by samples mm, akin to the way algebra works for instance complete words aren't fully expressed in fast speech only their initial sounds are somewhat perceived the example of a boy breaking the sentence the swiss mountains are beautiful into letters illustrate this concept like t s m a b so think about how sometimes you do things without really paying attention like cleaning or walking around imagine you are approach uh, a sofa you approach a sofa while cleaning but you are so used to it that you are not sure if you have already dusted it or not it's like you uh, your actions are automatic and you might not even remember doing them so this uh, text also uh, talks about uh, this way of thinking as algebraic it means that seeing things at shapes with vague outlines like looking at an object wrapped in a sack you recognize the object by its main feature like its its color like its shape but you might not remember all the details this kind of thinking is very efficient because it doesn't require a lot of effort the example given in about given is about forgetting whether you are uh, you have dusted a sofa while cleaning if someone is watching you consciously they can confirm what you did but if no one is paying attention it's as if those actions never happen especially if they they are habitual and unconscious it's about how our lives can go on automatically and if no one notices it's like those moments didn't really exist so uh text also talks about how the routine everyday things in life can become so automatic that they lose meaning habitual actions like um, work getting dressed or even relationship get fed into background the fear of war too can become just another part of routine there is a quote like if the whole complex lives of many people go on unconsciously then such lives are as if they had never been suggest that if we go through life without really paying attention to it it's like those moments didn't really happen then it goes on uh, to say that art exist to bring back the feeling of being alive it's there to make you truly sense things like making a stone feel really stony the purpose of art is to uh, show things as you experience them not just as facts so the technique of art is to make things seems unfamiliar to make shapes and forms a bit challenging to see this is because the process of really seeing something is an art in itself and should be enjoyed in the end it says that the actual object isn't the most important part of the art it's about experiencing the cleverness of cleverness or beauty of the object so 